All right, so this video, we're going to look at co-functions. Uh, these are the, here's your co-function identities. Uh, sine theta is cosine 90 minus theta. Uh, cosine theta is sine 90 minus theta. And I'm not going to read them all to you. You can see them. Uh, and, of course, these are in degrees. These, these all work, you know, it's the same thing if you had sine theta is equal to cosine of pi over 2 minus theta if you had it in radians okay instead of 90 degrees you would use pi over 2 <coughs> all right so let's look at this example so what I've got here all I'm doing here this is just a simple this is something simple to do we're just going to write each function in terms of its cofunction and I'll have a separate video where we're going to actually solve equations. Uh, I'll be working these problems here uh, where we're solving for theta using the cofunction identities. Uh, so check that video out too. But I'm just going to do these in, in two separate videos. So this one, all we're doing is writing it in terms of its cofunction. So for cosine of 50 degrees, well, that's remember cosine that's going to be sine of 90 degrees minus 52 degrees all right so we've got we've got 90 minus 52 so this would be sine of 38 degrees okay and this is all they're wanting so, you know there's there's a lot of trig books have these kind of problems in there all right, so let's look at tangent, tangent of 71 degrees. Well, remember the, the cofunction for tangent, that is cotangent is 90 degrees minus 71 degrees. And so that's going to give us cotangent of 19 degrees. Okay. And then we've got secant of pi over 6. So the cofunction for secant, that's cosecant. And so that's going to be cosecant of, now we're in radians now, so that's going to be pi over 2 minus pi over 6. All right. And so that's going to give us cosecant of, uh, pi over 3. All right. So the the main thing, I mean, I know that these are these are pretty easy. Uh, but the main thing is you've got to memorize these things, okay? You've just got to know them. Just remember sine and cosine their cofunctions, cosecant and secant and tangent and cotangent. All right. And just know those and you won't have a problem and like I said if you want to see the other video check it out I'm going to solve the uh, some trig equations using the cofunction identities so hope this helped uh, give me a like share and subscribe and thanks for watching